Operator Ashlyn Beacon and I am sitting here with Scott Campbell, Executive Director of the Ashland Area YMCA. How are you this morning? I'm great. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm blessed. Good. So I hear that the Ashland YMCA has reason to celebrate coming up. Yeah, we're very excited. Um, the Ashland Area YMCA has been um, in the Ashland area for 125 years this year, um, particularly this building, 50 years. So we're we're extremely excited about, you know, serving the community for that many years. It's just a, a great mark. So serving the community for 125 years, that is quite an accomplishment and yes. definitely reason to celebrate. And obviously you weren't around 125 years no, ago. I'm not quite that old yet. <laughs> but um, what do you feel like has some of the biggest changes that has occurred over the years? For the YMCA? Yes. Um, you know, I've been a member here since I was a little child, did swim lessons here, played basketball here, um, I, and I've seen a lot of changes, um, but the the constant steady thing that I've noticed are the programs, the mm -hmm. people, the fellowship, the connections um, has never changed. Uh, the family atmosphere is what we're proud of, and I noticed that as a, you know, non-member or I'm sorry, as a member, and then as I became a staff person, as I attended college, I worked here through college, um, I noticed the family atmosphere, and it's, that has never been you know, changed, and that's what I'm proud of. Um, so you've seen the building change a little bit. You know, we try to keep up with the times, but you know, as far as the YMCA, it's, it's always been constant for the community. It's, it is a great family atmosphere yeah. place yeah. and it looks like you have a lot of fun things planned for this yes. 125 year anniversary. Um, you want to tell us a little bit about that? I hear you're calling it the block party. Yeah, the block party. So my thought process behind the block party, we're trying to do this quarterly. Um, you know, it's hard to do in the winter months. So, mm. you know, about two or three times a year is where we're trying to plan to do this. But my thought process behind it was you know, we want the YMCA to be the center of the community. That's that's my mission as far as what I want to do for this YMCA as a CEO. Um, but, you know, some people don't like to work out. Um, so why not bring the community to the YMCA and we can, you know, fellowship and mm -hmm. become friends and get to know one another and, and see what we can do for the community um, outside of the walls of the YMCA on the property. And that was the you know my purpose of doing this to try to reach more of the community and give a, a, a positive thing for families to come and do. And there's always lots to do here at the YMCA. Yeah. Um, I have noticed ever since you have taken over as executive director, the YMCA has a really strong presence in the community. Like I go around to a lot of different events and there's yeah. almost always someone set up there yeah. with the YMCA and that's just a great thing. Yeah, it, you know, I want to, again, I, I feel like the Y has been a center of this community for years and years, and, you know, it's bigger than I am. It's bigger than anybody here, and, you know, obviously, 125 years, what a mark that is, you know, for this Y to be serving our community. Um, so we're, we're just trying to push the, the Y into the community more than what we have in the past, and, you know, that's been one of my goals as director. Well, I think you've done a great job accomplishing that so far. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, what can we expect at this um, block party? I, I hear it's July 30th um, at, from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. Yeah, um, pray for warm weather and sunny yes. weather, but you know, we, we've got indoor activity. We can come inside if it does rain, but we plan on doing it on our side lot. We'll have food trucks. We're gonna have inflatables for kids. Um, but the exciting thing is the Shelby Lore Band is going to uh, do a concert from one to three. So hopefully that and, and vendors will be set up uh, so you can kind of do a little bit of everything, bring your kids and enjoy music and let them play games um, and activities while they're here. We're also going to do open house. You know, you can mm -hmm. come in and take a tour of the Y. You can use the facility inside if you want to use the Y for the day and you don't want to join the outdoor activities um, we're, we're going to welcome you in our doors. Oh, well so. that certainly sounds like a lot of fun. Yes. We all look forward to coming to this and I thank you so much for doing this interview with me. Thank you so much. You're welcome.